And welcome back. Indiana State getting set for Southern Illinois later today. And Coach Lansing, I know you're fond of your whole team, but one of the guys you're particularly fond of, Christian Smith. Talk a little bit about Christian and the relationship that you guys have. Uh, it goes way back. Uh, it goes way back to when he was a freshman in high school and I was here and couldn't recruit him. You know, he was going to be above us. Uh, but I watched him, uh, uh, got to know him and recruiting guys from, from Pike High School. Uh, it's, I laugh about it because he was such an immature acting kid uh, when he went in there in those early days. But uh, now he's just, he's a terrific young man. Uh, he's a personality of our team. He's the best talker, uh, terrific leader. Uh, he's the type of kid that uh, you would want your, your, your daughter to uh, to Mary, he just a, he's a he's a really special person, and we're very fortunate to have a guy like him that works as hard as he does on his game, plays both ends, and then you go out in the community, and and he represents us in a first class manner. And that's one of the things for people who are around the program or get to see him really like about Christian how popular a guy he is. All his teammates really gravitate towards him. Oh, they really do. You know, the guys seek him out, and then when people get to know him in the community, they're the same way, and. Uh, staff and I will walk over across the street and at lunch and when you're over there and Christian's in there he's hugging everybody and talking to everybody he's just a he's a terrific ambassador uh, for Indiana State University in the athletics program and pretty good player too I know he hopes to continue playing for a while then he may end up hosting this show <laughs> he could host this show he could do it right now and do a heck of a lot better job than I than I can I know that and uh, the things he says he could be he could certainly be a coach uh, he probably he probably knows more than I do anyway right now, but we uh, we do a lot of talking on and off the court. He's a student of the game, and uh, again, it's a, it's why I'm in this business to to be around guys like that. Christian Smith, a junior from Indianapolis. Here's a closer look at Christian. It's been a long road for Christian Smith to get where he is now. After verbally committing to play at the University of Cincinnati, Christian ended up playing one season at Maine Central Institute. When he transferred to Indiana State. The Indianapolis, Indiana native had to sit out as the Sycamores captured the MVC Tournament Championship and went on to the NCAA Tournament. And for Smith, it was a learning process. I mean, I don't, I don't like anything being easy. So, I mean, I came in, you know, everybody comes in expecting to be in a man, come to be in that guy. But I had to, I had to take my growing pains, take my, you know, learning from older guys like a Jake Dolan and uh, guys like that. Dwayne Lake and those guys being here when I was a, uh, a true freshman. So, I mean, uh, just seeing how hard those guys work and how easy that. The game is not, you know, I thought, you know, I thought basketball was basketball. You should come in and play. No, you got you to gotta compete. You got to work hard. You got to know the game. You got to have a high IQ. And Christian is a special um, a young man and a good kid, and he's the, the personality of our team. Um, he, he's very unselfish and absolutely just loves basketball. When he finally got on the floor, the 6'6 swing man proved his worth, earning all bench team honors in 2013, following that up with the Valley Sixth Man of the Year award, all bench and most improved team member honors. I sat back and then uh, embraced my role and still wanted to be an X Factor coming off the bench. Um, you know, I came out guns blazing all the time, but I had a defensive mentality that, uh, you know, if Manny wasn't, wasn't going to, um, you know, have a good day that day, I, I was going to step up for him. And, uh, you know, I always want to be on the court. So, I mean, Coach Lansing preaches defense, so I wanted to play defense as well as I could. And, of course, I want to shoot the ball all the time. So, I mean, I came in there and got, and got a few buckets for us. I think just the way he attacks every day. He's just a very intense person, and I mean, he's a great player, but also he's a great person. And you know, a lot of people don't get to see the off-court Christian that we get to see. And he's just an all-around good guy. But when it comes on the court, it's business for him. And you know, he, he's going to be locked in and focused every day. He's not going to have lackadaisical times on the court. Like he's just always going to bring energy and enthusiasm. And that's what we need. Now the tide has turned. Smith is looked on as one of the leaders of the Sycamores in 2015, and the junior has accepted that role. He's a great teammate. Um, he's a positive energy guy. He's the most. He's the best communicator we have. Uh, one of our better players. Um, I'm glad we're going to have him for another year as well. It's been a struggle at first, but uh, just sitting back and watching players. Um, you know, they don't. Sometimes I try to force it too much. Sometimes I try to make a big play all at one time and, and not just letting the game come to me. You know, what I mean, um, you know, having that role. Obviously, I have a little more green light than I used to, so. I have a little more freedom, but I can't, all, I can't just get it all at one time. For the Missouri Valley Conference, I'm John Sherman.